Hello traders, FX Pipcoletti here. Today is Monday, May 22nd, and I'm going to be analyzing the Yo Yen starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame. So on the Yo Yen monthly, I still believe this thing is heading up. I think we're in a wave C. I think it's going up to about the 165 area to finish off what I think is a big A, three ways down for a B, and now we're in an uptrend for the wave C. So let's take a look at that on the weekly time frame. Weekly time frame is where you can see the last ABC within that bigger trend. Three ways down, impulsive up, higher high, higher high, still making higher highs. The trend is definitely still up. No Fibonacci bounce, no break of structure to the downside tells me that the trend is up and I'm still looking for longs on sort of time frames. Going down to the daily time frame, on the daily time frame, now we can see ABC down right to the 38.2 Fibonacci level, impulsive up. I do believe that right there is the end of a crutching and if it is, then it will go up. It will take out this high. I think it's probably going to take out this high and just keep on trending up. So let's keep all that in mind. Let's head down to the four hour time frame. On the four hour time frame, you can start to see the trend for the wave A, the three waves up for the B, and the trend for the wave C. Impulsive up, break of structure, so is us the end of this ABC correction. It's been making higher highs, higher lows ever since. Our last structure level is right here, and price has still not closed below that structure. So for me, the trend is still up, and I'm still looking for longs on sort of time frames at the end of pullbacks. So taking it right down to the one hour time frame. One hour time frame, I think we may have already had the end of a Kretzen. It does kind of resemble what could end up being like a wave A or like a wave B and maybe go down again for a wave C. I definitely am keeping that as a possibility before it continues up. But looking at it, looking at the fact that it has not closed below Strutzer, I definitely do see three waves down right there and I see a higher low. It does look to me like it's trending up and it probably isn't done. It's probably just going to keep on trending. So if I do see any pullbacks along on the way or we see it go down and make a wave C and then impulsive up with a break of structure either of those scenarios I will be looking for longs at the end of an ABC like this or I'll be looking for longs at the end if it does just continue the uptrend I'll be looking for longs the whole way up for the continuation of this trend so don't forget to join my free discord channel the link for that is on the screen and in the description thanks and happy trading